Most machines in our house live in our kitchens, so here are three hacks for your kitchen appliances. And before you start watching this, please subscribe, it really makes a difference. Number three, microwaves and the two C's. When it comes to microwaves, there are two C words that you need to keep in mind. Number one is the container. Container shape is critical if you want to heat your food properly. If you use containers that are rectangular or square in shape, the microwave energy is drawn to those corners, leaving those areas way overcooked. The number two seed word is condiments. If you use condiments, do not put them on your food until after you've heated it up. Microwave energy is drawn to salt, so if you sprinkle a layer on top, it's going to concentrate that heat and leave the entire outer layer of your dish dry. Ideally, you can salt afterwards, but if you're a real stickler and you like to do it beforehand, just make sure you stir it in evenly. Number two, the oven broiler. Keeping the door of your oven open or closed can make a big difference in the quality of your food. It may seem obvious, but if you're baking something like a cake, you want to keep the door closed. It allows the heat and steam to build up inside of that box called your oven, which really enhances the, just the bounciness and sponginess of your cakes. But if you're broiling food like a steak, sometimes you may want to leave the door open. By venting that steam and heat, you might get some of that crustiness and char that you're looking for. And you'll also ensure that you're not actually baking your entire dish, you're broiling it up top. It's a simple trick, but it'll make a big difference in the quality of your dishes. Number one, the dishwasher. In order to understand the science of dishwashing, you have to understand the two forces at play. One is the super high blast pressure water that's coming out of those rotating arms on the bottom of your dishwasher. That's your power blaster, and that's where you wanna put those dishes that just have those caked on, oatmeal, starchy type of stains that really need some force in order to remove it. However, the other force at play in the dishwasher is having soap remain on the dish for a longer period of time to marinate and soak into those stains, thereby washing off more easily. We're talking about eggs and yolk. Those type of dishes should go towards the outside of the racks, allowing the soap to slowly penetrate into the yolk and making it an easy rinse. Just like iPhones, our kitchen appliances have all sorts of different features and hacks. You can even hack into your oven sometimes to bypass the heating system and make it go hotter during self-cleaning mode in order to bake a pizza. Lots of cool stuff to do out there. And if you like this list, please subscribe and join our growing community.